Hello, everybody. Uh, here's our Friday forecast for our weekend services. As we uh, look ahead, we are now in our second uh, message on our new series called Ephesians. It's part of our, uh, the Bible project. I'd just like to encourage everyone a couple things. First of all, remember, bring your Bibles. Um, we handed out treats last week. I know some people said, you know, we were bribing people. Well, we're just trying to reward uh, behavior that we think is important. So um, come this week and uh, who knows, you might, you might get a treat. Uh, again, we just also want to tell you that with our Ephesian series, we're trying something new. We are um, having what are called shorter clips uh, attached uh, to our, our messages. And so you can catch a seven to 10 minute clip um, that's linkable through our Facebook and Twitter. Um, and we wanna make those also available through our website. So just watch that in the next few weeks. We're gonna have those shorter clips. Um, as we look ahead, um, we are also are just um, wanting you to put some pins on your calendar. Uh, there's uh, Pastor Carolyn's ordination. It's gonna be held here at the Allison campus. And uh, we are looking at that on November the 8th. Uh, we really want all three congregations and obviously um, a time of celebration as we as a church celebrate uh, Pastor Carolyn's call uh, to pastoral ministry. As well, we are of course thinking about our um, outreach event with Mike Gartner. Uh, this is an outreach obviously to our families and I'm just holding up that beautiful poster. We're gonna have some of these posters again available this weekend. If you know a place where you think you can put this up at a store, barber shop, wherever, um, love for you to grab a poster and put that around our city. Again, we also have these tickets and these are just free ticket invitations. So, um, you know, people don't really need one, but it's a great way to remind people uh, about when it's happening. Again, that's November 14th, Friday evening. And of course, there's the breakfast with Mike on Saturday morning at Crandall. Now there are paid tickets for that and you need to plan on picking those up. We're charging $10 per person on that. Of course, we also are thinking about other things going on in the life of our church, and um, I'm excited about um, our youth this coming Wednesday night. They um, are going to be uh, doing what's called Trick or Eat. It's a uh, food drive for the West End Food Bank. Uh, this Sunday night, they're going to be handing out flyers around the West End uh, of Moncton uh, to let people know that they're going to be picking up food then the following Wednesday. So keep them in prayer and encourage them when you see them. Um, also, I just want to remind you about our journey groups. Go to our website. If Again, we're just encouraging people to move out of rows into circles. It also, you know, I'm just going to throw this out. If you think God's leading you to want to host a journey group or something, please, please, please speak to Carolyn or myself. Well, finally, I just want to remind you that we are doing even this Friday forecast as a way to connect with you, but there are several ways that we are trying to connect with you within our church community and for you to share that information with others and beyond. So um, we're very active on social media. Uh, check out our Facebook at The Journey Church. Uh, you know, we're active on Twitter. Um, of course, if you want more information, please go to our website. We have a lot of stuff posted there. Um, you can, you know, surf our, our webpage. Um, but as well, if you're a member of our church, um, and we're just gonna keep now starting to inject this more into our language, you need to get active on our journey connection. It's kind of like our in-house Facebook page, but it's so much more than that as well. It's kind of like a, a digital church directory. Anyway, uh, that's the only analogies I can think of, but the point is take advantage of that as well. Again, um, looking forward to seeing you this weekend. Uh, there's, a, there's a chair uh, waiting for you here or at our Brentwood campus. Uh, God bless you.